endorsed by large YouTubers such as Mr. Beast, the Backbone One controller costs a whopping £100. Today we will find out, does the Backbone really live up to the hype created? Hello, I'm Chris and welcome back to yet another episode of Techify. So the Backbone controller released in October of 2022, which had a lot of hype created around it. A lot of uh, celebrities, a lot of big people in the tech industry were actually giving the Backbone controller to promote it and to just build up the hype, something similar that we see on the Nothing Gear 1 headphones. So to quickly go over the features, it's got an iconic collapsible design, extremely low latency while playing games, its ability to capture games, clips and screenshots during games, its 3.5mm headphone jack which, which you can plug your headphones into with a mic so that is very useful because the lightning port on your phone is already taken up by the controller so you're able to use a 3.5mm headphone jack for your headphones you can still of course use like wireless uh, headphones but it's always there if you'd like to use it on the other side you've got a lightning port to charge your phone while gaming or plug into a another bigger screen such as an iPad or a Mac. Personally I think it's a great idea. We don't really have much of a competition except the Razer Kishi which I don't think really lives up and isn't as good as the backbone it's not as well optimized. Going with the pros it can be used with any game that supports controller and also there is the backbone app which has community voice channels, library of hundreds of games within the backbone store. Uh, notifies you when your friend is online and starts playing can it connect to PlayStation or Xbox remote play and Steam link so you're able to also play your PS5 Xbox Series X or S games on there it works with all the games on Apple Arcade so if you've got the Apple Arcade subscription I really recommend this controller as well now moving on to the cons some of your favorite games might not have controller support so backbone won't really come in uh, any use for them can't be used with any protective cases because unfortunately the lightning port on the controller can't plug in it's quite expensive at 100 pounds uh, when you can literally get an xbox ray ps controller for like literally half the half the price the majority of the features in the backbone app unfortunately do require a subscription so it's a 50 pound uh, a year subscription and once you're spending 100 pounds on a controller you don't really want to be buying a 50 pound subscription over the, over two years that's 100 pounds that's as much as another controller so i'm not really sure if that's really what the customers will want however i guess that backbone had to implement it to increase profit margins i'm guessing so it's currently only available with the lightning port for iphones however apparently there is a usb-c model that's supposed to be coming in november 2022 according to the backbone website carrying on it requires an adapter for the iphone 13 pro max it is too large the iphone 14 pro and these 14s are all right However, the iPhone 14 Pro Max also requires this adapter. So to conclude the Backbone 1 controller, it is better than the Razer Kishi in my opinion of course. It's a great piece of kit, uh, if you don't mind buying the subscription price of course, because the subscription locks away many of the uh, extraditional features I talked about. And it might just be, or you just might be better off buying a PS or Xbox controller and just connecting that wirelessly to your phone. Actually the Backbone 1 controller of the iPhone reminds me slightly of the Nintendo Switch Lite light due to the size and how you how you hold it so anyways thanks a lot for watching check out the backbone controller on their website link down below all our socials also linked down below remember to like subscribe and hit the bell icon for more and leave a comment do you really think that the backbone controller is worth 100 pounds anyway thanks a ton for watching and we will see you around